Good morning everyone, I just made coffee, so my coffee's in here and today's vlog I'm starting with an unboxing, by the way I just came back from my holiday and I came back to this. So I placed a little order from Lalora's, by the way look at the packaging, it's so nice. In here, you guys know how much I love silk sleepwear. So here we have two new sleep masks that are 100% mulberry silk. I picked a pack of two, one in black and one in white. And you'll understand why in a bit when you see what else I got. So I'm gonna try these in a bit. But then, look at this pyjama. Look how beautiful. I chose the white one. I do not have a white pyjama. And this one looked so beautiful it looks so luxury and expensive and white is so pure as well so i really wanted this one with the black piping wow this is so nice okay this is better sorry guys i had to put on some lipstick because you do not want to see me without any my lips are so cracked and dry they always get really, really dry my skin and my lips from flying. I had a three hour flight, I came back home last night, so my skin is not great <laughs> and my lips are horrible, so I have to apply some lipstick before I start talking to you guys on camera. I really like the fit. I got a medium. I like my uh, pajamas to be slightly loose so I feel comfortable at home and when I sleep, when I go to bed. I love the feel of pure silk against your skin. It is so luxurious, it is non-abrasive, that's why I love it, it's really good for your skin. And one of the main reasons I actually want to try the Lalora's silk pyjamas is because their silk pyjamas are washable. The Lalora's silk fabric is washable and it still looks very shiny after washing. Lalora's is a revolutionist in the field of silk pyjamas. They have upgraded their silks and they produce really, really good quality silk pieces. You can see the beautiful sheen. It drapes so nicely as well. So highly recommend their pieces. I'm definitely going to try out some of their other pyjamas. I got the long sleeve and long bottom set because it's winter. <laughs> We're getting into winter. It's getting really cold in the UK. So here we have the two sleep masks in black and white and they both of them go really nicely with the pyjama that I got because it has black trimming. Okay, do you think I'll ruin my makeup? <laughs> I'm not going to put it completely on, I'm just going to hold it like this, but you can get an idea. It is a very, very uh, soft fabric again, silk is non-abrasive, so it's great if you suffer from any skin conditions like acne, it's good for your lashes as well. And also they are made from leftover silk fabric, because Lalora's cares about our planet, and that way they do not waste materials. Guys, Christmas is around the corner, so this would make such a beautiful, luxurious gift to a loved one. I would personally love to get something like this for birthdays or Christmas gifts, so just giving you some Christmas ideas there. But do check them out, they have free worldwide shipping and also an amazing 180 day returns and exchange policy. So yeah, let me down my coffee, because <laughs> it's quite full still, so I'm gonna down my coffee quickly and change and show you today's outfit. Let's do that. <laughs> so I'm just gonna put some earrings, I'm gonna wear these Hermes little locks, padlocks. Let's put on a little bit more Hermes, I'm gonna tell you why in a bit. <laughs> I'm gonna wear this beautiful poncho today.
Before I go to Selfridges, because I'm planning to go to Selfridges after, I'm going to Hermes first. I received a call from my essay, actually not a call, a text message from my essay, that an item that I've been wanting, it was on my wish list for such a long time, is finally available to collect. Before you ask and get too excited, it's not a handbag, but it is another item that was on my wish list for six months. I was waiting six months for this. So I'm gonna go collect it finally and then we are gonna go to Selfridges, see what's new. I definitely want to check out some more Fendi, some more ponchos, because I do want to get another poncho and um, some boots as well. So let's go and see some new cool pieces for fall winter. And yeah, hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Let's go shoppy shoppy. <laughs> Hi guys, so I'm doing a quick voiceover because I couldn't really film at Hermes, you know how it is there with security, it's quite hard to vlog, but I did take some pictures, so I wanted to show you some of the items that caught my eye. There are some new sneakers, we have some leather goods here, some of the Oran charms, some exotic wallets that I saw. I love this brown one especially. There are some fine jewellery pieces on my Christmas wish list from Hermes and I wanted to go check out some of their bangles and the rings. So in the next clips you can see some of the bracelets I had a look at. However, it turned out that most of the stock is sold out and it's very very hard to find these bangles the cdc bangle and the kelly bangle in larger sizes they only had very very tiny sizes available and they said it is possible to order but it might take up to six months so it would be impossible to get it on time for christmas but i wanted to show you some of the bracelets they tried on anyway although they weren't the ones I wanted because I definitely want either the Kelly or the CDC in yellow gold. Here you can see me trying on the Kelly bracelet with diamonds in white gold because this is the only one they had in my size and also the CDC in rose gold. So I would have to patiently wait for the yellow gold but at least I got to try them on and see what size I am, how they fit, how they look on and I wanted to share the clips with you as well and here I also tried on these two rings that I'm also eyeing but again they didn't have in my size I love the one with the diamonds, which one do you guys prefer? Okay guys, I just finished up the Hermes and now we are outside Selfridges. I think there is a new Prada pop-up. Let's have a look. Look at the window display. It's like a winter Prada pop-up with some colorful uh, puffer jackets, ski wear as well. Definitely not my cup of tea. I don't really like this print as much and the colors. Okay guys, as you can see, I'm in Selfridges <laughs> and this is my Hermes, I asked them to put it in a white bag because I didn't want to attract attention but inside we have a big orange bag. So yeah, let's have a look around Selfridges and see what's new. <laughs> I haven't seen this style before, it's like a half sneaker, half boot. <laughs> there isn't really much, but these are from the new collection, the Camellia Flats, 830, and they come in this color as well. So I didn't vlog much at Chanel because they didn't have anything new. Um, I've already shown you pretty much everything <laughs> in my previous vlogs, but they told me when the new collections are launching, they're launching one after another so the coconage is launching this month it's a very small collection winter collection 
winter capsule collection and then next month i couldn't believe the cruise collection is launching oh my god so soon these collections are dropping so quick one after another so yeah bear that in mind everyone's talking about celine lately i see it all over social media especially these white sneakers but let's see what else they have and there is this pair of loafers i like the burgundy and then we have oh i like these boots these are beautiful i love the leather as well very soft lambskin and then these also i see all over instagram they're really cool check these out alexander wang i love the bling bling detail these are very cute oh my god look at these mimi puffer boots to be honest I've been eyeing the Louis Vuitton ones, but I can see many designers this season are releasing similar styles. Let's give these a go. Also, I think I'm going to try these. Shearling. I love the cognac brown color with the lining inside. Okay, let's see. <laughs> these are so cute. They're not my size, but... Um, I just wanted to try them on see if they look ridiculous on. I've never tried the puffer style boots before. Okay, do we love or hate? <laughs> I actually think they look really cute with uh, leggings. Just plain casual outfits in these on when it's really really cold. And my feet are always cold in the winter so these will be amazing. Let's try on these as well they look very warm here is the price let's see the price of these as well these are 820 here is the teddy bear <laughs> sneaker from Mew Mew so adorable aren't they so I've shown you these before I think I even tried them on my phone is not focusing today I don't know what's going on but yeah, these are the newest Fendi heels. I love them. I love the heel, but very uncomfortable. I find them very uncomfortable. I tried them on. I do love these boots from the new collection. They also come in a taller version. Also, these grey beautiful Colibri shoes with the same calligraphy print. It's like a velvety fabric. Oh, finally guys I found these I've been wanting to try these on I saw them online and I've been eyeing them for a couple of weeks so I was very curious to see the color in in real life and they look stunning so I'm gonna try them on also these are new I haven't seen but they're very heavy And then these are the classic style of boots. These come out every winter, I think. So I think they're in the classic line. They're the same style, just different color. These are new, I think. These um, loafers with the small GGs. I think these are from the Balenciaga Gucci collaboration. They're kind of cool. Not these. <laughs> these I don't like. Love this new color. So beautiful. Oh, 
hello i love these guys these are not in my size my size is sold out so these are quite snug these are size 37 i need maybe 38 i would say i really like them i love the thicker platform and they're very lightweight as well I think all brands are doing this style now oh my god I love these they're so cute but do you wear them at home or do you wear them outside <laughs> these are definitely home slippers here the other styles these are the same as the brown ones yeah let me know guys would you wear these out or just at home Oh my god, no, 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 this is so ugly, <laughs> I'm sorry, but oh no, they have the same hat, and it's a bucket hat, it's like fully lined with the same faux fur inside. Here are some of the new Prada bags, I'm not really impressed, I don't like them, nope. You know, I've been eyeing some of these nylon jackets. I'm gonna try a few different styles and they have that very trendy puffer one as well. What do you guys think? Yay or nay? So this is the less buffy version, it comes in a longer style as well, I'm gonna try it on. This is the shorter one, but it's definitely less buffy. What do you guys think? Is this too trendy maybe? Which one do you like more? I'm gonna try the long version of this as well. I actually quite like this short one. So which one do you guys prefer, this or the first one I tried on, or the short one? <laughs> Let me know in the comments. I feel that this is a bit more classic, the other one, the first one I tried on um, is very trendy. But yeah, let me know what you think in the comments.
Oh, I love this tweed Saint Laurent bag. Such a beautiful, bright pink color. Can you guys see this? I think it's like a brooch, Saint Laurent brooch. They have some new caps as well. I think I saw this online in black and white as well. Oh my god, this is so cute. <laughs> like why so underwear? Okay, so this has been on my wish list for I would say a month. I've been eyeing it online. It's so nice. But I'll, I'll wait for Black Friday. <laughs> they might have it discounted on Black Friday. I wanted this color, but the logo looks a bit tarnished on this um, brownie color. Oh, look at this, just caught my eye. Isn't this so beautiful? It's a cropped black cardigan with sequined YSL logo. I love this t-shirt. I have a similar one in black though. And also I wanted to show you these cycling shorts. I love the YSL logo at the bottom. So cute. So I'm in the fitting room and I'm gonna try on two new ponchos. I actually quite like, I initially I thought this comes with the poncho because it's a new style, but um, turns out it's a brooch and I actually quite like the idea. So um, I'm gonna try this beige one instead. It's like the black I showed you, but it's um, in this beautiful beige color. And this is the classic one that they have almost every year <laughs> so i will just try this because i saw this stout with a with a pair of boots i'm gonna actually insert the screenshot because this will be such an amazing look with a pair of leggings in the winter these sunglasses um and the poncho and the boots oh my god so yeah i'm gonna try these two okay so this first one i actually don't like at all it looked so much nicer on the hanger maybe it will look better in black but it's just so big my poncho is big but it's not that big <laughs> um so yeah, it looks a bit weird i don't like it as much as i thought i would this is how the brooch looks pinned um so i think i'm gonna steal that idea and get a brooch for my poncho to wear it with a brooch okay so this is definitely uh, yes, this is similar to my one and it is reversible. You can cut the tags on the inside and reverse it and wear it on the monogrammed side or just belt it um, and wear it like this. I really like this one. This is so elegant, especially with high knee boots um, like the black ones I showed you. It will look amazing. So now the question is, do you guys prefer this one or the one that I showed you in my Fendi vlog? I will insert a clip here um, so you can let me know which one you prefer. <laughs> oh my god, look at this peekaboo. I love the peekaboo style. It's such a classic bag and this one is so special. Look at the Fendi Zuka print inside and it has gold hardware. I'm still thinking about selling my one to get 